Okay, so today we're going to talk about how to create a vendor credit and how to apply it to a bill. So let's create a bill. Um, let's go to bill and let's create a bill for Bob's Burger joints. Let's say that's travel meals and it cost us a thousand dollars on the 19th you want to fill it out terms um, bill number one two three and so on so now we're going to hit save bill is saved Let's go ahead and close. Let's go to expenses. And now we have the bill for Bob's burger joint, one, two, three, thousand dollars. Okay. So now let's go to the plus up here and go down to vendor credit. And since we're applying it to Bob's, we're going to look up Bob's Burger Joint. It's going to be for travel meals. And you're going to create the, you can enter a note here what the vendor credit is for. And you could put three, four, five, etc. In this case, it's going to be $200. You hit save and close. Now that's saved. So we see the, uh, the vendor credit and the open bill. So now when I go to make payment, and I'm gonna write a check for Bob's Burger, the amount is 800, and the reason it's 800 and not 1,000 is because the credit has been applied. Now if you don't want to apply, you just check it off and the amount will go back to a thousand. But on this screen, you'll see that the vendor credit is available for us to use. So we're gonna go ahead and add it. And once again, we see the, the amount owed is 800. Check how you're gonna pay it. All the information is correct. The reference number and so on. And that's how you apply a vendor credit to a bill. If you like this video, please uh, feel free to subscribe, hit the like button, share it. Any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below, and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you so much.